Hey guys, welcome to GGS Wildlife. Just doing a little intro video today to show you all the birds that I have and what might come in the future. So these guys are a pair of my cockatiels. As you can see, there's a bit of grated carrot because they don't like eating the um, full pieces on their own, but if they feel like chewing on it, I've got two pieces sitting there for them. Here I've got my white Indian ringneck and on the ground there behind her, or him, I'm not sure, is my female green Indian ringneck as well. And they are quite noisy as it is. And here I've got a bit of a mixed cage of mostly male cockatiels. So I've got three male cockatiels, hello. And then I have one green cheek on you up the back as well. He's a bit of a character as well as this young cockatiel at the front. And we've all got a bit of character today. And here I have my peach face lovebirds. Which are also a breeding pair, but I'm not breeding them at the moment. Any of my birds at the moment, because they have a bit of a rodent problem. And I don't want to lose any of my birds from the rodents. Or any of their chicks or eggs. Because the mice and rats, unfortunately, will eat their young in them. So, yeah. Also, while I'm here today, I might also go over the cage setup. So um, this one is a custom made one that my grandfather and I made a few years back. If the camera will focus on the birds. Um, <laughs> it's not going to focus. Um, so it's about six foot long by about three and a bit foot wide. Um, used to breed in your ringnecks in here but I no longer have a breeding pair, so I ended up putting my cockatiels in here, tried to breed them, but they don't breed anymore, unfortunately, as my male's a bit too old to um, fertilize the eggs properly. Um, over here, I've just got two cheap-ish, they're about $100 each from the um, pet shop. I used to have budgies in here, Breeding pairs of buddies, and I've also used to breed my peach pieces in these cages. They're about, oh, I'd say, four or five foot tall cages. Just a temporary setup. I'm hoping to get some suspended Avery soon for them. Uh, this cage here is about three foot by two and a half foot. Uh, made by my uncle, who gifted it to me when he no longer wanted his birds. Hey, little fella. And then this cage here, which the peach races are in, I have a bit of shade cloth here to keep them protected from the sun and all predators, because keep them protected from the sun and all predators because it is rather open. Um, this one here was gifted to me by a friend. It's a bit of a rough shape, so I'm hoping to get these guys on a suspended Avery too. And this here is my very excited and enthusiastic green bellerichi. Um, also in another cage like the ring next. Hopefully he can get a better cage soon. Um, he was a rescue bird that my cousin found and we took him in and yeah he's been great ever since. And then we also have our Resident, well not resident, he's a pet, um, Muscovy Drake, who follows me around like a dog no matter where I go. Hey mate. Well anyway guys, that's it. It's a nice short video. If you guys have any questions or want to give me any tips on anything, let me know down below and I'll see you next time. And we also have our beautiful dog Dakota. He's a big as silk and loves cuddles. As a show. <laughs> Down. Too good. He is always hypo and ready to go. Now bear with me. I'm a bit camera shy because this is my first time doing this sort of stuff. 
So I thought I'd read the video with the dog.